the careful consideration and review of the current situation and the result of events in Clarendon, His Excellency the Governor General has declared a state of public emergency for the parish of Clarendon. The Honorable Prime Minister has advised the Governor General to make such a declaration on the recommendation of the Chief of Defence Staff and the Commissioner of Police. Our informed assessment is that high levels of violent criminal activity experienced within the specified areas of such nature and such an extensive scale that it endangers public safety. This large single account of murders within the parish of Clarendon is attributed to ongoing violence between within the division that had reached a tenuous magnitude resulting in the eventual perpetration of murders as a means of intimidation and further as a form of reprisal as gangs seek to dominate existing turf. State of Emergency was declared on the 23rd of November 2023 in Clarendon and expanded on the 6th of December 23. During this period, the division experienced one shooting incident only. This amounts to a reduction of 100% in murders and 50% in shooting incident over this 14-day period, when compared to an equivalent period of time prior to the SOE, during which three murders and two shooting incidents were recorded. This state of public emergency comes not only as a single act, the government will be attacking gangs in all sections of Jamaica. There were four curfews across the Southern Belt last night in the division, the Clarendon division, and in the corporate area. There are multiple operations across the Western Belt and outside of Kingston in areas where it is known that gangs operate. Several people were detained. The police will have those details. Events of this nature will be met with the full force of the law and the government will not be shy in taking all steps to provide the police with required powers to do so.